in the last tutorial video we looked at uh, the help menu and before that we just looked at a kind of overview of the ID so what we're going to do now is we're going to uh, create our own program now uh, and to do that we press uh, this icon up here which is the new icon and I'm going to zoom in just a little bit just so we can get some uh, some clarity here on uh, the ID you can just zoom in a little bit more. Okay, this uh, main blue area is your editing uh, zone. This is just a, your standard text editor. And we're going to start off with a really super simple program. It's not going to do anything spectacular, it's just going to print hello world. So we just type in the keyword print. Now, print displays uh, either text or numbers uh, in the, the console window. Uh, the console window is clicked on through here and we'll show you that just in a little second hello world okay so that's a super simple program to run the program we click on this icon here uh, this little asterisk here if we can just zoom in for a little second here this little asterisk here means that this is this editor has been marked as dirty which means that you really should think about saving your file before you run it but luckily Blitzmax does that for you anyway and it gives you a default untitled 3 here because uh, this is the third editor file which also means that this is the third attempt I've had at recording this so anyway um, so click on this to run it and you see it takes us straight to the console window which is the output here uh, this is standard across Blitzmax on the Mac which is what I'm running just now and Linux and also the Windows uh, applicate, um, Windows operating system and you'll see that the print hello world does indeed print Hello world on the output window. Okay, not the most enigmatic of programs, but you can do whatever you want. You can type in hello slowing just to change that there. And when we run it this time, it will say in a second, it will say hello slowing. Okay, and once you've finished editing your new program, the best thing to do is to save it. Now, remember, it, it does save it in here. Uh, so you can recover it from from a complete disaster and failure and all that kind of stuff but uh, you really want to save it to posterity to somewhere nice in your hard disk drive so uh, file save and up pops the, the dialog box again this will depend on what your operating system is so just save it to some location that you, you feel um, you want to to uh, save these things to so we'll save this to our blitzmax folder and we'll call it hello world and then just click, click on the big save button down the bottom and we're done. Uh, well you can actually see it changes to hello world up the top there and now we're done.